Hi there, this is Nick Jeffrey, and I'd like to welcome you to the wonderful stadium south on Velodrome in Invercargill, New Zealand, which of course is venue for the 2012 UCI Juniors World Track Championships. And here it is in full race mode. We're just four sleeps away from the world's best junior riders strutting their stuff out on the boards of the Velodrome. We've already had something of a sneak preview at our Curtain Razor race night, which we put on last weekend. New Zealand and South Africa's junior world squads really put on a show for us and gave us a taste of what to expect when competition kicks off on Wednesday, August the 22nd. Here coming into view is Tom Beadle winning our men's Kieran final on the night, which uh, ended proceedings last Saturday. We've been busy out in the community, as you'd expect as well, promoting the uh, Junior Worlds and also the sport of track cycling. Here we are at the Brewer's Elbow. Uh, thanks to the ILT, we've been running a roller racing challenge at some of their establishments. We've also put hundreds of secondary school students through a virtual time trial on the rollers. You can see how it works. And uh, as you can see, the bigger kids at the Brewer's Elbow certainly earned a drink uh, after their uh, blowout. Uh, on Wednesday night. Ultimately though it's uh, right here inside the velodrome where our attention has been. The official training sessions have started. South Africa actually earned the first of bragging rights as the first of our 24 countries out on the boards. Host New Zealand began their uh, Invercargill uh, leg of their build up earlier this month also after uh, preparing in the US and Australia and speaking of our trans-Tasman neighbours of Australia, uh, they've arrived looking sharp complete with bleached blonde hairdos for the boys, looking good lads uh, and uh, golden haircuts but will there be medals to match? That's the real question. First First day of competition comes up on uh, Wednesday. Between now and then you can check out our official website at juniorworlds2012.com and we'll catch you tomorrow with more news as the world comes to ride right here in South of New Zealand.